A unique and powerful type of component pattern is now available for setting up pattern components along an open or closed path to dynamically simulate a chain drive or cable carrier. Let's look how to set this up. The fixed bracket is fixed to the origin. There is a sketch to define the shape of the chain that is mated to the front and top planes, which means it can move back and forth. The floating bracket currently has only a parallel mate to the top plane, and the link has no mate supplied. When you choose the chain component pattern, there are three options. The distance option is similar to the path mate, but allows movement. Select the path individually or with a selection manager, then define the number of instances or choose to fill the entire path. Next, choose the component, its spacing, its location reference, and location plane. That's it. For this example, we'll fix the chain sketch and you can see that we can move the link along the path. The distance link option is similar but requires an additional positioning reference to locate the link along the path, but it still allows for defined spacing. The connected linkage option is what we want for this energy chain. Let's define this chain to have 19 links. If there are multiple links, such as a bicycle chain with alternating links, a second chain group can be added and its reference is defined. Now that's starting to look like what we're after. Next we'll mate the first link to the fixed mounting bracket and the floating mounting bracket to the end of the chain. Then, when we float the chain sketch, the energy chain behaves perfectly. It even stops when it reaches the limits of the path. When this energy chain is assembled and made flexible in an assembly, it moves and behaves exactly as expected. For the top cable carrier, this definition is a bit different. Since the angle of the upper portion of the sketch needs to change, the chain sketch needs to be rebuilt. This sketch is built in the context of the assembly and does not offer real-time movement, but a rebuild will solve for the position of the chain. 